Christian, thanks for having us at Mantra M4 and Palm Cove in North Queensland. It's, a, uh, it's another warm one up here, but uh, thanks for having us. And the resort looks fantastic. It, uh, it always does. But uh, we're up here to, to follow up on the, on the install we did on your gates. I think it's about 10 months ago now. Uh, we came up to help Michael from Tropical Pool Inspections retrofit some soft closing hinges to your uh, security gates and see how they're going and get a bit of feedback on, on you know, what's, what's important to, to the resort as far as the gates and how they function and things like that. So, but how, how are the gates functioning? I, I think they've received really well ever since installed because they, from original install, they've been installed with the normal hinges and the self-closing hinges or the, the shock reduction hinges. And yeah, it's, it, it caused a lot of problems within, within the guests and the occupants of the complex. So once we moved them over into the Polaris ones, we, we started to really have lots of positive feedback on the noise reductions, the way they're closing, the, <clears throat> the security on it, which was paramount for, um, for the body corporate here to keep, the, to keep those gates in place so it doesn't, they don't stay open, um, which was again like something that happened before regularly. You know, you, you have to, because we're sitting on the, on the ocean front, we have to adjust it to numerous kind of weather situations, like especially with the wind, um, it's a problem. So you're doing it too light, they stay open. You're doing it too heavy, you're gonna get more and more um, complaints about the noise. And the installation with the Polaris engines actually saved all and, and reduced all of those occurrences. So we're pretty happy. That's fantastic news. We're in the process of developing hinges for this type of application where there is a problem with noise and guests that potentially their time around the relaxation and, and things like that around their holidays gets disturbed by slamming gates, really making sure we solve that problem. But uh, the security is, is a massive one that, that if the gate doesn't shut, it's, it's a waste of time having a lock. So power close is the product that we've installed to make sure that it comes back and latches. And we're really happy that it, it's uh, worked out for you guys. Yeah, it certainly did. I mean, you, I guess the installation was good through Michael and the soft closer works consistently. We really can stay on top of the gates and, and how they work and how they're supposed to work and then sort of really have only good feedback. And the, the power closer as well, which was the problem that we used to find on, on low wind conditions, you know, you set it all up, the low wind conditions then really impacted on the closing itself. That really solved that issue for us as well, um, all across. And um, I mean, you know, the guest satisfaction and the occupant satisfaction when you have a, a bedroom right next to the gate is, is pretty paramount, it's pretty, pretty yeah. high. Absolutely. And just a quick one, the, I noticed that there's Polaris soft glass hinges on all the pool fencing gates. And, you know, typical aluminium pool fencing, it doesn't necessarily need a soft closing. The, a spring hinge will, people typically use a spring hinge. But one thing we noticed is the, the function with a soft close hinge on, on even those aluminium gates, it's so much nicer. It's, you know, if you've got guests on a sun lounge right next to the gate, oh, yeah. it, it makes the whole feel of it is completely different. Well, as you, as you know, like that's how we actually got onto the main gates through you guys, because we had them installed first. The reason we installed those ones is similar, similar reasons is one, the, the reliability on the other ones just often really let us down. The guest satisfaction and the, the comments that we had on pool gates, again, like we, we, we have big complex, we have got a lot of bedrooms next to pool gates. So again, the feedback from guests and occupants to, to noise interruptions during the night is, is just sort of was there all the time. Once we tried and tested the, the, the Polaris hinge on the pool gates, it cut that out too. And, and you can see that it just works for what it's intended yeah. to do. Yeah. And uh, yeah, like I said, the maintaining is, is, is required, but you, you definitely have that consistency on, on closing and, and the noise reductions there, definitely. Yeah. Yeah, look, it's, for me, it gives an example of, the, of, of management taking their guests uh, into consideration as far as their comfort goes. You know, I would suggest uh, it's, it's the next level of, of comfort for your guests. And it's, I, I think it's a big one. It reflects on the attitude of the resort. You know, it, the comfort of the guests is paramount. And I, I think it's a, it's a big one. Yeah, thanks. And I mean, it's one, one of those things 
and one of those, I guess, issues that, that you can fix. And it, it took us a long time. I mean, we, we looked for hinges, for pool hinges and for options for a long time because, again, like, not everything is, is, is conforms to standard when you, when you develop a big place like this. So you've got larger gates and smaller gates and everything works differently and then the pool, the pool compliance changes. Um, and it just was always, it always missed the mark a little bit on, on a couple of gates. And, and like the Polaris gates definitely doing that a lot different now and a lot more consistent. Yeah, look, you know, we, we've built into our product the best adjustments we, we can make, you know, because we understand that a lot of these hinges are going to be in difficult environments, you know, there's one's in a wind tunnel, the other one gets kids winging on it, the other one is this and that. And one thing that we've found is really important is to, to build in ease of adjustment. So the maintenance crew can actually go through and actually relatively easily adjust it to, or, or readjust it to op optimum function uh, without spending too much time. They don't have to, you know, unscrew it from the gate and then re-screw it in different holes. It's a, the adjustability has become uh, something that we think is really important and uh, I hope maintenance feel the same, you know. Oh yeah, they, they do. I mean, you, you're right, the, the maintaining of it is always going to cost you some time and, you know, sometimes you, you just have to get it right back to standard and back to op optimal. Um, I think, you know, the maintenance crew is pretty happy about it and all the rest is really just on, you know, nature and as well as longevity of the product. That's right, yeah. Look, you know, I absolutely appreciate you being the uh, visionary that looks after their guests. They're going to improve everyone's comfort, but uh, is it something that you would recommend to, to other resorts? Yeah, we do, definitely. And we already done, so I think like your, your product is in Palm Cove now and another property as well. It's active on how we now have guest satisfaction and, and even our own satisfaction because we don't want to have guests come to us and go, this, this slams or can we do something? Oh, I woke up or, you know, it's, it's just one of those an, annoying noises, you know, and, and from that perspective, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Just yeah. Thanks, Christian. Really appreciate it, man. Nah, it's all good. I appreciate it. Like I said, like we, we actually looked a long time.